Well, Labour has been let off the hook, it looks like. Lindsay Hoyle, who reportedly, I'm saying reportedly, was in the Labour Whip's office today, it seems has selected the Labour amendment, meaning that they don't have to vote on the SNP amendment anymore, calling for an immediate ceasefire. That now means that Lindsay Hoyle has taken the role as John Burkhall, letting his own party leader off, and meaning that there'll probably be no rebellion now on the Labour benches. How cowardly of Lindsay Hoyle. Next time Labour put an, a motion forward and the SNP might put an amendment, Lindsay Hoyle has now set precedent, which is very unusual, where he would have to surely even it out and accept an SNP amendment to a Labour motion, which Labour wouldn't be very happy about if the shoe was on the other foot, would they? And the Tories are also kicking off about this, obviously because they can both see it would have damaged Labour. But still very dodgy from Lindsay Hoyle. Clearly, he's been put under pressure by Keir Starmer, and this is why we shouldn't have a sitting MP as the Speaker.